The advice from experts was simple and direct. Tear Wrigley Field down and start over, just as was done with Tiger Stadium, Comiskey Park, and Yankee Stadium. Then in 2009, the Cubs in Wrigley Field were sold to the Ricketts family, and Tom and his family made a courageous decision. They would finance saving Wrigley Field for the next generation of Cub fans. We're here today to acknowledge the contributions of and to thank all those with us and so many others that couldn't make it today who worked to assure that Wrigley Field will be here for future generations. Our three pillars will stand the test of time and now Wrigley Field will as well. New video boards, new concessions, restrooms, and equally important, great modern player facilities. And all of this was accomplished while preserving the historic charm of Wrigley Field. This rededication is a recognition that it is the fans who have made Wrigley what it is today. With its new designation as a national historic landmark, its status as one of the gems of Major League Baseball is truly established for all time. Let me also say to our fans, we know our current play on the field is not what you expect or deserve. And we assure you that winning another World Series continues to be our number one goal.